everyone, this is Kasha, Feeling Artsy, and today we're going to learn how to draw jeans. We're going to draw skinny jeans and loose jeans on the same exact body type. To complete this project, you will need a piece of paper and a pencil, and then something to color with. I'm going to use markers and colored pencils. I have already drawn these two bodies. I did it with a colored pencil and I wanted to make them as similar as possible. So we have the same pose, but we're going to draw two different types of jeans. I'm going to begin drawing skinny jeans first and then I'm going to draw the loose ones. The first thing I'm going to do is to draw the belt. Now, depending how low or high your jeans are, you would do this a lot lower or a lot higher. You know, if you have the low jeans, then obviously that would be, it'll be a lot lower. But this is just um, decoration in a way. Now the jeans. The skinny jeans are easier because once you have done your body and you feel like your body's pretty good, the jeans pretty much stick to it. So you're just going to draw a line right outside of your body. Now they're going to have a fold around the knee and then go down. And if you want to roll them up, you would just draw a little rectangle at an ankle. And then again, you can make it skinny or you can make it pretty thick and go up with it. Now this leg is turned this way, so these jeans are going to fold a little bit here like this. And then again, uh, really close to the body. And just follow your leg almost like drawing leggings now you might have a fold here now here's the seam and then there will be a couple folds here we can add the pockets and same thing on the other side so really close to the body I folded the knee and um, close to the body Folded the knee, and these folds are different because these wet legs are facing different ways. Half and um, rolled up half. So that's pretty much for the skinny jean. Now the baggy jeans. So same thing. Let's match our waistline. And now, because these are loose, they're not sticking to the body, there's going to be a lot more folds here. And, um, and then the jeans will not be so close to the body, so you want to go further out when you draw them. So you draw the fabric hanging outside of the body, and they may have some folds here. And there will be a big fold around the knee and go down and again they're going to we can do a cup so a rectangle like shape but it's not going to stick to our leg so it's going to be on the outside of the leg now you want your dream to go inside the cuff here and then out of the cuff and then here we're not going to have a gap like this because they're hanging there will be some folds here. And same thing on the other side. So loose folds around the knee, down to the cuff, draw your cuff, and they're hanging. The cuff is not touching the leg. And same thing on the other side. Uh, these will be wider here and then pretty loose. We're gonna maybe fold right here around the knee and we can add the pockets and the pockets will also be kind of more to the outside so they're a lot wider. Now to color our jeans I'm going to first outline them 
with a little um, liner marker. Then I'm going to come back in with the eraser and erase the pencil lines so it's not so busy. And finally, I'm going to color. I'm going to use alcohol burst markers to color these. I'm going to make the skinny jeans light color and the loose jeans dark color. So first I'm just coloring in the whole entire pant. I am not going to color in the rolled up cuffs because when you do that, the jeans are lighter on the inside than they are on the outside. I'm going to use the a little darker markers for some shading here. I'm going to use the light blue colored pencil for the lighter tones and also to kind of show the texture of the jean. And you can do that just by little cross hatching lines like this. Don't want to use anything shiny on your jeans. I mean, the jean fabric is not really reflective. It's kind of flat. And on these, I'm going to use like a really light gray. You can barely see it. What else can you do with your jeans? You can make them ripped. And uh, for that, I'm going to just use a white gel pen long ribs everywhere you can't really see it very good on these skinny jeans because they're so light but let's put it on the dark one so how about we do a little bit here and some above the knee right here what if i put tiny ribs all over these Okay, there you have it. Skinny jeans versus loose jeans on the same body type. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to give me a thumbs up and come back to see me soon.